Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to Super Mario Odyssey. We're back in the Metro Kingdom to collect all the moons that we can here. So let's head up to the very top of the city to start off. Because there's one power moon in the air that we've seen that we probably all need to get. But there's also, I believe, a... I think... Maybe I'm wrong. I think I... No, uh, no, maybe... I think there's a, a secret area around here. Actually, I think it's down there. Or something. Hang on. I feel like it's here. Oh, there it is. There's this uh, moon block pipe that we can go down here. And this is a interesting area. Because it's very dark. And out of the darkness comes these guys. Which you don't actually want to kill, you actually want to use them as platforms if you can, but it's very creepy having these guys out of the darkness. To be honest, there's a lot of small pathways in the middle of this place as well. But anyway, if we can get this guy over here to make a platform for me, we can get right up and grab this Muna over here. Scaling Pitch Black Mountain, it's actually a really cool place. I really like its design. Also, there's some hidden blocks here that we can use to get over to this little island here. For the other power moon. Reaching Pitch Black Island. Okay, let's move on and probably head back to the top of the city again. Also, it's interesting when you're in a secret area because when you teleport out, Cappy just goes in a direction, basically. And it's just super random looking. Uh, but anyway, let's use these forks here that weren't here until you beat the game to, I believe, get a power moon around here somewhere. It's probably further down there. Oh, is it in... Is it in this building down here? Or is it in this box on top? It's probably just in this box on top since it's glowing. And that's going to go on top of the sign. Yep. So now we just have to get to the sign, which is pretty easy. So there we go. Out of a crate in the city. Uh, back up to the top again because I need to jump for that one that's in mid-air. It's just literally just in the mid middle of the air. So you basically just have to go all the way up here and then jump for it, basically. I think I'm still not high enough, though. Just here, maybe? Nope, got it. Perfect jumping. Hanging between buildings. It's not really hanging, it's just there. I missed that bird. I don't know if I need that bird. I feel like I do need that bird though. It's probably one that I haven't got yet, so... Uh, I have to find it though. Which is easier said than done. Oh, is it right there? Did it just pass me? Or is that just a regular bird? I think it might have possibly been a regular bird. But where is this... Where is it? <laughs> Hang on. It might be worth getting the toad hint so it marks it on the map. But I can't choose a specific moon for it to tell me where it is, so I have to just do my own thing then. But anyway, let's go into this. Oh, there's the bird down there. Actually, I think this is a good, a pretty good spot for this, actually. I'm pretty sure I've been here when I got it in previous playthroughs. So, it's going to go up here at some point, I believe. Maybe. Oh, there it is. It's going around. I didn't know when it was going to go around. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There it is. I could jump for it now. Oh, that might have been a good idea, actually. Now that I think about it. Please get it. Thank you. Oh my goodness, that was close. Is, it gonna, is the moon going to come down? No. Okay. Well, that's fine. I can jump up for it. Like that. Bird traveling in the city. Okay, now let's get that one pipe that's on top of this building over here. Just like that. This is an interesting level. We've got these swinging beams. And we've got hammer, hammer bros. So let's grab a hammer bro. Let's grab a bro. Just, it's, it's, it's important to grab a bro at some point. Make sure you have a bro on hand at all times of the day. Ok, 
Okay, and now we need to take this as well as we can. Ooh, it's bouncing, it's bouncing, it's bouncing, it won't stop bouncing. Uh, and we need to take this, uh, this hammer bro, or any hammer bro. These ones will work as well, so. We need to break these blocks here. Just like that. Power moon. Swinging scaffolding break. Get over there, please. Thank you. I don't know how I made that jump, to be honest. Get up there. And I don't think I actually need this guy. How did that one die? This one, this one was dead. That's interesting. But anyway, let's just get over to this moon and we're done. Jump. Okay, uh, let me just quickly double check something. Just because I feel like I'm missing something. I am not really. Okay, so... Wow, we've cleaned this up pretty quick. Uh, there's only a few regular things to do though. Uh, but we've also got Cooper Speed Racing. Which, this one's actually an interesting one as well. Because we have to go from here to, I believe, the swimming pool area. And it's also going to be raining for this, so that's cool. I like rain. Okay? Just, I like rain. Just give me more rain. More rain. Now to do an absolutely terrible job of this. Okay, this is good though. This is actually a very good position to actually just go straight over here. Oh, unless I do that and miss the platform that's over to the right. I didn't see the platform because it was too dark. I mean, it's not like it's too dark, it's just I didn't see it with this lighting. I just needed to adjust my eyes a little bit, I think. Okay, grab that, and then aim for the platform that's over there. Bonk, anyway. Let's go up, and we can use these forks that are here to get to the top. There's a lot of these forks though, oh my goodness. There we go, 28 seconds. I'm not sure if that's ex extremely good. It could be. I feel like there's another way to get up there with the, the electrical wires as well. Let's do another one for the Master Cup. And then we'll have to have a look at the rest of the regular moons in this level. Since regular moons unlock after the end of the game as well. Oh please, bounce properly, thank you. Oh, I bonked again. I was trying to avoid that. Can I beat my previous time? Yes. 27 seconds, nice. I'm always happy to be in the green. New PB, maybe. I don't actually keep track. New PB on this specific profile. Okay, let's see, that's all that. So let's go to Talkatu and find out what's up. Because I think we have to find Peach in this kingdom, and there's also another moon that I can think of. A request from the mayor. Yep, that one. Do we already find Peach? Powering up the power plant? Yeah, I could do that. And those are the last two, I guess. I guess Peach... Do we find Peach already? Maybe we did. There's also a few other things we have to do in this kingdom as well, apparently. That it's not telling me about. But yeah, we have to actually go back into the underground power plant again. So let's go do that and just roll there, apparently. Get that out of the way, and let's hop down. Oh, 
Okay. Do I need to go all the way through? I might. Just because I don't think there's a quick way in. Which is unfortunate, but if you miss those purple coins in this area or the moon, the secret moon, it's a good opportunity to get those now. Nice. So over here we have this uh, battery block and we need to get it into the slot with the right angle to make it fit into the hole. So let's do that. And I think I just made that completely reset. So good job me. Oh, and there we go. Perfect. And now we've increased the usage of wasting the moon's energy just for our own power source. I mean, it's going to last a while, but it's not going to last forever. Probably. Powering up the power plant. So many moons. So many moons. I just want, like, Scrooge McDuck, um, like his, his vault thing. But it's just completely power moons. Just, I want that. Um, I think that's almost everything. So let's go talk to Pauline about this other thing that we need to do. Hello. I've been waiting for you, Mario. Yeah. We heard it all about your hero heroics in the, mush the Moon Kingdom. Truly a hero's hero. Uh -huh. You've come a long way since we met. I wonder if you'd like to learn a bit about me. Maybe in a quiz form. Sounds like fun. Here we go. Question. What is my most treasured possession? A purse. Is it? Yeah. Lost that a long time ago. Unfortunately. Apparently I don't know this quiz. Uh, what kind of music do you do? I like peppy music. Correct. I like music that brings uh, people together and gets them moving. That's my favorite. Here we go. Question. Which of these things did I actually do a long time ago? Uh, captured by Ape. Correct. I knew you'd remember. It was traumatic at the time, but it helped me make me the person I am now. Here we go. Question. Give me your honest opinion. How am I doing as the mayor of the city? Fantastic! Why, thank you. I'll keep working as hard as I can to be a good leader for everyone. Here we go. Question. What kingdom did I like to visit? I would like to visit right now. Seaside. I was actually just there, so I'm definitely going somewhere else next. Okay. I th there's probably a way to actually get these answers, but anyway. Uh, what do I plan to eat for dinner tonight? Fried mushrooms? Yes. Oh. Correct. You're a mushroom fan as well, aren't you, Mario? Uh -huh. Here we go. Question. Mm -hmm. What do I just adore? Um, well, it's not machines. Is it... Cake? Maybe do you like machines? Hang on. Flowers, cake, flowers, cake, cake, flowers, cake, cake? <gasps> Correct, but I, it has to be uh, good cake, not the packaged stuff. Here we go. Question. What do you think my hobby is? Um, driving RC cars? Oh my goodness. I don't think I've ever had some of these questions before. I usually just get like a handful and then I... I know other answers to them. Machines and I have never gotten along. I've never even touched an RC car. So I know the answers to the ones I've heard before. Uh, what do I like to do on my days off? Practice singing? What am I bad with? Fixing machines. <laughs> Talk, talking to people. Yeah, that's my one. Correct. Machines and I do not get along at all. Here we go. Question. 
What kind of music do you really like? Peppy music. We've already done that one. What is my most treasured possession? Uh, a hat? The hat you're wearing, and it looks like we got all of the answers right. Yes, this hat is my favorite of all the things I own. Thanks for taking the time to chat. It's good to catch up with old friends. I guess I'm feeling sentimental today. It, uh, today is my birthday. Did you know that? No matter how old I get, I still get excited about presents. So, there are a few presents that we can grab to give her. Not sure if this is the right gift for the mayor, and it makes the Mario... No, the Donkey Kong item sound effect. But there's this umbrella here. Which she doesn't want. Thanks for taking the time to chat. It's good to catch up with old friends. My birthday. What's that in your hand there? Oh, an umbrella. Is that a present for someone? Guess she didn't like it. Absolutely roasted. But anyway, there's also this hat here. I don't think this is the right gift for the mayor. It is not. What's that in your hand? Oh, a hat. Is that a present for someone? Just absolutely brutal. But anyway, the I don't think there are any other ones, but the correct thing we're supposed to do is go up here. Because up here is a purse that she lost. This looks like a good gift for the mayor. So let's take this to her. It's got the coins going around it, so you know it's what you need. Thanks for taking the time to chat. Yay. The same text again. I see you have something in your hand there. Is that a purse? It's lovely. Is that a present for me? Wonderful. Wonderful. You figured out exactly what I wanted. I've been without a purse since I lost mine that terrible day. Please accept this in return. A request from the mayor. I'll be sure not to lose this one. Okay. That was a lot of things done. Um, let's see, what else do we have left to do? We might actually be somewhat near done. But it says there's another five moons to get, so I must be missing something. Uh, I can at least account for one of those being something we can't do yet. Talk to give me the knowledge. Surprise, clown! Don't give me a surprise, clown, please. Peach in the Metro Kingdom, so we haven't found Peach. Okay. I, I thought I thought something along those lines. Did I have a hint already for something? I probably have. I've probably got three hints already, and I just didn't realize it. Um, found with Metro Kingdom art. Wait, have we not done the Metro Kingdom art one? Oh, is that... That's the one... Oh, my goodness. That's the one that I kept forgetting to do in the Lake Kingdom. Okay, then. Well, let's do the rest of those, then. So, there's two that we can't get due to not being able to do them just yet. So, let's buy a new outfit, the clown outfit. 200 coins total. And yes, on that side of the screen there is a outfit that costs 9999 coins. Also look, there's Luigi cap and the War what a Luigi cap and a Don Diddy Kong cap and the and the Wario and the Bowser's wedding outfit and the bridal veil and there's a lot of things. The Super Mario Sunshine hat and like the shades and outfit. So many cool things. The, there's also the brutal outfits as well, and another 9999 item. And these are all so expensive, but the 8-bit Mario cap is cool as well. And I think, yep, there are even more that we haven't even unlocked yet until we put stuff in the Odyssey. So that's something we'll need to keep in mind, probably. But for now, we're a clown, as you do. Just I'm a clown now. 
So let's launch ourselves. Not quite that way, so we can actually run on the ground a little bit. For some speed. And if we go back here with this clown outfit. There's just one guy over here. Man, I could go for a laugh right now. If only there were a clown around. But wait, you're a clown! Ha 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 ha! Hilarious! <laughs> oh, did he just... Like, is it because I'm wearing a clown outfit or is he just calling me a clown? And then... Is this just like the biggest roast of all time? A <sighs> few. Wow, I needed that. As thanks, please take this. Hee <laughs> hee. I'm pretty sure he's just insulting me and just laughing at me. Surprise clown. So, let's do something as quickly as possible to change out its outfit before my eyes burn. I mean, it's too late already, but still. Oh my goodness. I need to change, I need to change, I have to. It looks terrible. Ah, much better. Original clothes. It's probably even weirder to mix and match the outfits. Some of them could work pro together. Now, where is Peach? Is she at the end, or the beginning, or in the space, in the sky? Where would... Oh, hang on. What's that? Okay, it's just saying getting the city back up and running. Don't think Peach is up here. And I can't remember where she is, which is surprising. You can press down to take a snapshot. Well, it's not what I'm trying to do right now. Also, there's something else I remember that I can do as well. So let's get a scooter. If that doesn't make sense, it will in a minute. Scooter, scooter, scooter. Give me the scooter. I'm not sure if I can use this scooter to get where I need to go. Um... Well, that's fine. I can teleport. Probably. Hopefully. I think I actually will have to go up to the top again. Maybe Peach is up there. There's actually something else up there. Possibly? I think there is. Because I don't think we've gone to the very, very top of this area recently. I came close, but never all the way. Okay, so... Football? Why is there footballs everywhere? I don't know, but there goes that one. Uh, doesn't look like Peach is up here. But let's... Use this scooter. I'm pretty sure I've already done this moon, uh, but I'm trying to do something else at the moment. So, let's ex accelerate just into the void all the way over here because over here, oh my goodness, this is really weird controls, but anyway, uh, we can park our motor scooter here. I'm pretty sure this is the only way to get our motor scooter in this spot. Congrats, you're the very first customer to park your motor scooter here. And we got a moon. A <laughs> leap of faith. For free parking. I took a leap of faith and all I got was this parking spot. Uh, where is, where is Peach? I don't know. <laughs> I feel like I should know. I've played this game so much. And 100%ed it pretty much every single time I played it, I'm pretty sure. So it must be somewhere I just haven't gone. And that's where Peach is. I don't think Peach was in that area over there. I should probably actually go to the Hint Toad. And buy the information I need for stuff. Just gonna double check, not there. Um, also the hint art is gonna show up, so I'm gonna waste a few coins probably on doing this. 
Nope, that's actually where Peach is. Cool. Thank you for reminding me exactly what I needed to know. And not just give me other information that I knew already. So kind of the game to just tell me things I wanted to know. Imagine if that was a normal thing in video games. Slightly joking. Oh, don't do that, please. Hello, Peach. The buildings, the people, the taxis, there's so much to see here. There's so many people here, I'm a bit overwhelmed. Oh, I almost forgot. I found a power moon in the crowd. Add it to your collection. Peach in the Metro Kingdom. Wow! Okay, oh, nope, 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 get away! Get away! So, how are we doing for this kingdom now? 79 out of 81. I'm pretty sure that's everything. Cool. Perfect. Absolutely amazing. Because we've got the hint art and then another one we can't do yet, so... Let's head on over to... Which kingdom is it, actually? Is it the Sand Kingdom? I think it's the Sand Kingdom. Oh my goodness. It's been forever. Well, here we are. So let's go open up everything. Oh my goodness, that... How did that launch in that direction? I don't even know. But anyway. Let's activate this thing. And now... It begins. It's not going to take that long. But anyway. I say that as if it was going to take a while, but it's not going to actually take that much time. Anyway, starting off over this way, somewhere, is the Jaxi, but also something else around here is what I'm actually trying to look for. It's somewhere around here. Oh, that's the edge. Isn't it? Where is it? Am I wrong about this being here? No, I can't be. Hang on. Oh, it's just lowered down. Too far north. Where am I? Like, actually, where am I? Oh, is it something moving? No? It's just right here. Okay. So we've got to take some notes, which I'm already going to fail because I'm going completely off course already and out of line. But maybe if I turn around quickly... No, there's no way. But yeah, we have to get that lined up before we actually go and get started, otherwise it's going to be pretty bad. Just like that. And it's nice to see green power moons again. Not going to lie. It's very nice. Out of all the colors for power moons, it's been, it's been too long since we've seen a green one. But anyway, let's go ahead and go this way. Because we have some stuff to do over here. Um, we've got this way we've already done. Pretty sure. Pretty sure we've already done that. Uh, but there's also a power moon up there to get. And also, if we go over here and... Go to our pictures so we can see the screenshot we took in... I think it was the Bowser Kingdom. Of this. And it was the Bowser Kingdom. Very nice. Let's get this one that's up here if I can. Oh, that was close. Just ground pound here. You know, now that I'm thinking about it, it's cool that each kingdom has its own colored moon. But I just... My brain was like, what would happen if... You could have multiple colored moons right next to each other and be like, oh, that's cool. 
diff multicolor moon. Oh my goodness, gradient moons. Like the... Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, rainbow moons! Ah! Uh, multiple colored moons! My brain is just overloaded with desire for these things. I want, for one, levels with multiple colored, like, all the different colored colors of moons in it, and also moons that have multiple colors in them, and just, I'm, I'm just, my brain has been completely overloaded with things that I want to see as for moons. Anyway, while my brain's trying to process all the different colors of moons ever that could possibly happen, that is it for now. So thank you all for watching. Well, that's a shame. I don't think it, it might have had a moon. Anyway, that is it for now. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.